Hey guys, my name is Magnus Freud and I am the artist who's done the drawing you're going to see now. And I am also the owner of the video blog thehardworkingdreamer.com and it is really fun for me to show you this today. And why is that? Well, it is because this drawing is quite frankly the best I've done ever, I think, in my own personal opinion and I'm very happy with it. And this drawing and the other one is not only special for me because they are, you know, a, a leap forward in my development, but also because they represent something I've wanted to do for a long time, and that is going deeper into portraits and also combining nicely rendered realistic portraits with more textured, uh, like chaotic parts. And you can see the soft background I've let in now, and that's going to be manipulated later to be more textured and more chaotic. And what I'm doing now is just uh, adding the basic rendering, I wouldn't even call it rendering maybe, but just the basic shading and later I will refine that of course and also add the background, you will see that in just, uh, just a minute here. For a long time I've thought about doing these kinds of portraits but you know as a creator there can sometimes be a fear of creating and I felt like man am I really gonna be good enough, will this go well, am I just gonna you know fail totally or uh, you know so that kind of hesitation has been with me and now I've decided just to go for it and just be brave and create what I want to create. And this one on the other portrait is a, really represents a new development in my own artistic uh, expression. And that is exploring contrasts, I would say, in portrait form. Black and white versus color, light versus dark, smooth versus rough textured and chaotic versus highly controlled. Like in this one, the background would be rough and textured and chaotic, and the little girl is smooth and highly rendered. And I just like that nice contrast. It creates a, an interesting tension and life in the drawing. Here I am adding some of that chaotic splatter with acetone on a brush, throwing on the acetone violently so that it affects the, like pushes away the charcoal. Here I am adding my signature and fingerprint to the drawing as a representation of me finding my artistic voice through these portrait drawings that I will be doing throughout 2018. That way a piece of me, a piece of my skin, will quite literally always be in the drawing.